Hey there, welcome back. In this lesson, we're going to finish the bracket that we built in our previous lesson. In this video, we're going to apply fillets and the mirror tool. Notice that we didn't use any fillets at the sketch level. You might be wondering why. Well, generally, in my opinion, Imho, it's a good idea to apply fillets at a later stage of part creation. Why? This helps you avoid any unnecessary mistakes. In my experience, it's a good practice to apply your cosmetic features in the later stages of the design process. All right, let's create a fillet to begin with. We're going to activate the fillet command. We'll use a constant size of fillet, radius of 10 millimeters, tab to register. Let's scroll down to fillet options. Make sure that select through faces is checked. Another general design principle, when you apply fillets, don't try to apply as many as possible in one take. I'll try that in this video so you can see what happens and how to troubleshoot a situation like that. Let's go ahead and select multiple edges. You can see the preview in yellow line in the graphic area because I've got full preview selected. And I'll just continue with my selection here. Almost there, and one more. That'll do it for now. Let's click Accept. Let me just zoom out a bit so I can take a better look. Looks all right. Okay, let's activate the Fillet tool again and keep going. We'll still work with the constant size type, radius of 2 millimeters, tab to register. And let's begin my selection in the graphic area. Okay. Let's apply some more fillets now. This will be of 3 millimeters, constant size. Notice that I've got tangent propagation checked too. Let's pan our model a little so I can continue my selection of edges. I'm going to select a lot of edges, more than I would usually just to see if we can create an error. 